So this could be closed off and made into an office with some French doors here if you wanted to. Oh, it's very tall in here. So here you have your dining. Deep closet. Powder room. Washer and dryer on the main level, which I personally like more than having an up two car garage. Family room, gas fireplace. Open to the kitchen. Gas, which is good. We love the backyard. Uh, Trex composite deck, they last a long time. Very quiet. You can hear the kids at school at recess. These neighbors don't have anything outside, so I don't think they spend much time out there. There's a good space between the homes. They're not that close together. <laughs> Unfinished basement, but massive. So these people have two offices going on in this house. This is like the man cave, it seems. Lots of potential to do whatever you want down here. Okay, on the front of the house, we have an, another office slash bedroom. The shared bathroom. You do have neighbors there, but you have to give and take on some things. And by the way, you'd probably always have it closed because it's a bathroom. Lots of natural light. I mean, there's only two windows in here, but lots of natural light. Deep, big closets. Still on the front of the house. They love wild paint, that's for sure. primary bedroom. Lulu loves this house, by the way. Like, loves it. Like, let's move in tomorrow. Big bathroom. You could even put a door there if you wanted for toilet privacy. The closet's okay. It's not being maximized the best it could be. I'd put a system in here. And what's really nice is the primary. Oh, look at her. <laughs> Backs to the woods. 